right now, Robin Julie, here at the Richmond Airport. We are slowly seeing the impacts of that novel coronavirus. A few of the passengers here are wearing face masks, others are wearing gloves, but the majority of the travelers I spoke to today say they are not canceling their plans. Since the coronavirus is here, we're trying to like play it extra safe. After spending spring break in Virginia Beach, try and like not to touch anything. Joey Layden will soon board a flight Monday from Richmond International and home to Boston. I've been using hand sanitizer almost everywhere I've gone. He's one of numerous travelers keeping the coronavirus on their minds. I saw one gentleman wearing a mask today and I did notice some people kind of cleaning their uh, chairs on the plane. I've got a hand spray and I'm going to spray my hands and spray the area around us. In response to the emerging virus, a TSA spokesperson tells me their agents can now wear face masks when screening passengers. Delta announced plans to fog planes arriving from overseas, a robust sanitation effort to prevent the spread of coronavirus. It's been a little crazy in the travel industry. Travel agent Kim Goldstein manages Journeys Inc. in Short Pump. Two cruises and one land-based Italy vacation cancel. She says her clients aren't panicking. A few canceled trips as a precaution. One was an elderly couple and she has some lung issues that she's currently being treated for. The CDC recommends social distancing. Advice echoed by VCU infectious disease expert Dr. Michael Stevens. Stay away from large crowds, uh, places where you're going to be within six feet of other folks for prolonged periods of time, maybe an hour or more. Yeah, people are generally concerned. Concerned, but these passengers remain cautious. I'm not worried about it really. I just feel like it's just going to run its course like a flu. And some travel insurance companies, as well as some of the airlines here at Richmond International, are easing restrictions for certain passengers, allowing families to change the dates. But generally speaking, here in Central Virginia, the coronavirus not yet impacting the travelers in our area. Working for you in Richmond, I'm Brendan King, CBS 6 News.